one mistake! We have killed thy pilot, Mr. President! No one left to fly the plane! And no parachute! Whatever happens, you lose! And I win! Tonight I come to you with a pledge to change America's policy. Atrocity and terror are not political weapons, and to those who would use them, your day is over. In a speech tonight in Moscow, the president issued a direct challenge to terrorist nations around the world. But the question remains, what are the risks involved in such a bold policy initiative? They hated your speech, didn't they? We're afraid we won't have the guts to back it up. Air Force One, clear for takeoff. Thank you for your hospitality, Moscow. Where's my family? The president's plane, Air Force One, has been hijacked. What do they want? They want General Raddick released from prison. I will execute the hostage every half an hour. Where are airborne scenarios? There are no airborne scenarios. My husband will not negotiate. His wife, his daughter, I think he'll negotiate. How the hell did this happen? How the hell did they get Air Force One? Your national security advisor has been executed. He just bought you another half hour. Sir, your parachute. I'm not leaving without my family. You know who I am? I'm the President of the United States. Jim isn't making this decision as a president. He's making it as a husband and a father. Go! Let's not forget this president is a Medal of Honor winner. He knows how to fight. He has no right to take chances with his life. We cannot give in to their demands. We've got a job to do. It makes me so proud, Mr. President, that you stuck with us. You know your father. He has also killed. You're nothing like my father. We're tracking six MiGs. I'm sending in our F-15s to protect you. She said MiGs? In a war, people die. The president is up there with a gun to his head. I'll do anything to save my family. Don't ask me for something I can't give. 